In this video, we're going to learn how to break a link uh, from a document that has been uh, that has a chart or table in it that is linked to an Excel document. So we're going to open this test linked file. It's a Microsoft Word document that has in it a chart that we created in Excel and we previously linked it. And what that means is that um, whenever changes were made in the source document, which was Excel, then whenever we open the Word document where it is linked, we will receive this message that says the document contains a link that may refer to other files and do we want to update it. If we want to break the link, at this point we say no. We click on no. We don't want to update the file. And so then we're, we're left with the um, Word document and we haven't updated it with any changes that have been made since the last time we opened it. Now to break the link, we need to go into the object that we copied over from Excel and uh, press our right or click, right click um, somewhere within that object. And then we're going to point to the linked worksheet object and we're going to click on links at the bottom of that drop down menu. And so then our links dialog box comes up. It tells us what the source file is and our source file was an Excel spreadsheet. We make sure that the source file is highlighted for the link that we want to break and then we simply click break link. Excel asks if we're sure that that's what we want to do. We click on yes and then the link between the two is broken and this um, that has been copied over from the Excel spreadsheet is simply now an object that's been copied over. If I double click then it opens um, the um, Excel um, Oops, sorry. It opens the um, formatting uh, toolbar because it assumes that I want to format an object within Microsoft Word. So now when I save it and close it, I'll do that and then I can show you, and reopen it, I will no longer get that message that says it's a linked document and do I want to update the links. So basically to um, to break the link, you right click on the object that is linked. Uh, you go into the dialog box, you make sure that the source file is chosen, and then you click break link. It's that simple.